hello friends welcome back to the another video that is for the elements of civil engineering and mechanics it is the first semester subject it is uh, code is 18 civil 14 and 24 that is in first semester fourth subject and second uh, sorry in second semester fourth subject also okay so this is the matter of concern for most of the students uh, who are from another branches other than civil and mechanical engineering and it is the core subject for the uh, what we call the civil engineering uh, and also in the mechanical engineering there are some concepts from this particular subject so my dear friends in this video i want to discuss some important questions for the uh, vtu examination probably a uh, day after tomorrow uh, the uh, examination will be there for this subject that is elements of civil engineering and mechanics okay so in the model first you have to cover theory all theory you have to cover most probable questions i will discuss it over here that is explain the role of civil engineering in the infrastructure development of the country this is the most important question and next one is uh, state the scope of civil engineering in structural engineering geotechnical engineering and transportation engineering so these are the scopes of uh, civil engineering over there then next one is the state and explain basic idealization of mechanics okay so then next part is effect of infrastructural facilities on social economic development of a country and also two terms are over there that is and laws you can see that state and explain parallelogram law of forces and prove varignan's theorem of moments okay so this much is the theory con content in the model first over there you have to focus on this much part so that it will be easy for you to score 20 marks at least at least i am taking over here you can easily score uh, 20 marks in this particular mark uh, particular module over here okay then module second comes up the most important question is which i am uh, saying to you that it is the super important question in the model second that is state and explain lemmy's theorem and uh, explain limiting friction and laws of friction sometimes they may ask laws of dry friction over there so don't be confused it is a similar question as that of the laws of friction over there and also definitions uh, they will ask sometimes that is coefficient of friction angle of friction and also go for go for the problems like uh, tensions in the string they will uh, ask you what we call calculate the tensions in the string sometimes in the cables also if you find some difficulties or uh, cable problems then go for this particular problem it is almost asked in uh, two or three papers as far as vtu examination is concerned that is find contact pressure and at uh, surfaces of contact for the system shown in the figure for two identical cylinders this is the similar problem go through the sun star refer to the sun star it is uh, precise over there and a little bit uh, i think uh, four or five lines will be the answer for this particular question so go for this uh, and just memorize it if you are not uh, taking concepts from this particular problem over there so just memorize that particular question it will be definitely asked in the video examination then module 3 comes up so in the module third you have to focus on the load supports so here the question is the state and explain different types of loads with neat sketches and also different types of supports you have to focus over there and also the assumptions made in analysis of trusses it is most important to question in this particular module over here that is assumptions made in uh, analysis of trusses over there okay so also problems out on beams if you are convenient with the beam problems and also truss problems are there but they are lengthier ones uh, you just focus on the problems on beams two or three you just practice uh, so that in the examination you can just write the uh, given data if you are facing difficulties in the examination if you are not understanding the questions over there so at least you are uh, writing you will be writing the given data over there so that uh, for the given data evaluator may give two or three marks okay then sorry uh, this problems will be like uh, find the reactions at a and b a and b are other are the supports so reactions are acting at the supports you know that so you have to calculate that uh, reaction forces at uh, different points over there these are simpler ones you just go through and focus and ponder on that particular problems and also one question theoretical question uh, difference between determinate and indeterminate beams over there so this much content is enough for my dear friends for the model third over there then model four comes up so in the model four this one is the super important question that is state and prove parallel axis theorem and also some definitions moment of inertia centroid center of gravity and radius of gyration and polar moment of inertia and also 
calculation of centroid i mean that determining the centroid of given shape they will give you a shape like i section they will give a semicircle and uh, sometimes circle over there and sometimes different shapes irregular shapes you have to uh, what we call the determine the centroid over there so go through the sun star i think sun star may be better for you to cover over there to focus uh, on this particular subject to pass the subject as it is uh, the matter of concern for most of the students so my dear friends you can easily score in this module for also by covering this much this theory concept over there this one this one is definite question over there that is state and prove parallel axis theorem so don't miss it don't take lenience in this particular module then module fifth it uh, it is actually uh, 12 or 13 marks are just in your pocket my dear friends by covering some theory concepts like uh, defined trajectory time of flight as 12th class you have focus over there you have come across the 12th class PVU. so you have uh, just read these topics were there that is trajectory time of flight super elevation curvilinear motion rectilinear motion and also displacement definition velocity definition acceleration retardation and path etc etc so this much is enough uh, to cover over there uh, this is the theory concept and almost it uh, carries 10 marks over there and also state and explain d Moore's principle and next newton's law of motion as you may already come across these type of laws were there newton's first second and third law and also super elevation and importance of super elevation i think this much content is enough for the model fifth to secure 12 or 13 marks in this particular module you can easily pass my dear friends if you just refer this much content only you can easily pass this subject i hope so you will do it this time you will kill it you will conquer it this time so best of luck for your upcoming examination for this particular subject that is element of civil engineering and mechanics so thanks for watching my video my dear friends